During the Quarles administration, we have moved Kentucky hemp from a research pilot project to full-blown commercialization. There's no denying hemp's growth in the past four years. Obviously, hemp is something that's being touted by my opposition right now, but right now the hemp program is kind of like the Wild West in Kentucky. There's all kinds of issues with it. Uh, the people in Western Kentucky have contacted me just in the last 48 hours trying to find out where they have outlets to try to sell the crop this year. Ryan Quarles says his steady leadership has made Kentucky the leader in hemp. We're starting to see um, some little glitches in the system right now. But as with any new market, there's going to be folks that, that are, succeed, some folks to decide to exit the market. But right now, Kentucky is the clear leader. Robert Conway says he would use the office to push medical marijuana. One acre can generate $40,000 in revenue. Now, how much of that's profit is going to be dependent upon how much you're willing to work it. Well, I'm not against medical marijuana, but we have been given a chance in Kentucky to promote hemp. Quirrell says he has also grown the Kentucky Proud program for locally grown food. Conway would like to stop sending cattle raised in Kentucky to other states. Kentucky is centrally located. We have an abundance of water. So why not bring those finishing facilities back into western Kentucky? Mark Vanderhoff, WLKY News.